ET is short for evapotranspiration, which is the combination of evaporation from land and water surfaces and transpiration from plants. It is how water returns to the atmosphere and can be thought of as the opposite of precipitation. ET is happening all around us all the time, but because water re-enters the atmosphere as water vapor, the process is invisible to the human eye and very difficult to measure on the ground. After water vapor re-enters the atmosphere, it is usually transported by wind currents, so it's unable to be used again within the local water system. For agricultural and other vegetated landscapes where human water consumption is limited, ET often approximates consumptive water use. Of the water that falls on or is applied to the landscape, 40 to 100% will leave as ET. Because of this, ET data can be used by farmers and water managers to create accurate water budgets at farm, water district, and watershed scales. By making high quality, field scale ET data widely available, OpenET aims to transform water management in the West and beyond to ensure we have enough water for farms, people, and wildlife for generations to come. Learn more at openetdata.org.